All right, the Nashville Public Library has branched out. They got lots of stuff. Oh, yeah, and I mean, they call it the Library of Things. Ed Brown is here to tell us all about it. Kettlebell sewing machines, and what is this called? That's called a kibasa. Oh, my. Okay, how does it work? So it's real simple. Just like with books or anything else you usually check out from the library, you go on our website, on our catalog, you find the thing you want, you put a hold on it, and we'll take it to any of our 21 locations you want to pick it up from. This is so cool. Super cool. I love it. Now, your mission is to provide equal access regardless of financial situations to people all over. Tell us how this all came to be and why it's so important. Sure, so we looked at what other libraries are doing because they have similar collections of things and we thought, this is Nashville, we can pull that off. So we wanted to do that. And we were looking and we see this as an extension of what we're already doing, right? We got folks who come to the library, hey, I wanna learn more about making ice cream or getting in shape. Cool, we can give you a book on it. Now we can say, hey, we'll give you an ice cream maker to go with that book or a kettlebell if you want to start working out. So it's an extension. And then finally, we want to show people like who may be thinking, mm. well, I don't read. I'm not a reader. The library's got nothing for me. Wrong, man. Check this out. <laughs> yeah. Stuff here for you. Wrong, man. What Wrong. are the popular items that are being rented out? Okay, so I mentioned the ice cream maker. Yeah. It's gone. Okay, I mentioned uh, kind of surprising, like radon detectors, the indoor air quality monitors. That stuff got chucked out real quick. Mm. A lot of the fitness equipment, like the Pilates bar, the kettlebell, those have all been checked out. In fact, most of the collection is checked out at this wow. point, and there's already a hold list growing for it. It's pretty incredible. <laughs> That's amazing. How long can you keep something checked out? Up to three weeks, and wow. then if there is not a someone else on the wait list for it, which right now there will be, mm -hmm. um, but if there's not, you can get that renewed up to three times, so potentially up to nine, 12 weeks at a time. Mm -mm. That's amazing. Now, what is not in the collection of things that you want to see in the collection? So that's a question I would pose to Nashville. You know, this is really driven by what do our customers want to see? What do they find useful? What would be cool to them? So we're asking people, hey, go on our website, library.nashville.org. Hit us up on Facebook or Twitter and let us know what you'd like to see in the library Ooh. of things. Can um, people donate stuff? Oh, yeah, that was, yes, wondering. Good question, but no, not right now. So okay. we bought all this stuff brand new, and we're going to try to maintain it as long as we can. But anybody who's a pre who would like to donate, Thank you, but not right now. Gotcha. Okay. Mm -hmm. My gosh, I mean, we've got tools. What is this? Uh, 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 that is a blood pressure monitor. Okay, a blood pressure yeah. monitor. We went over the instrument, baking equipment. I mean, you've got it all. This looks yes. incredible. And then you deliver it to the branch that's closest to the person. Was that what you were saying? That's right. So say, for example, you usually go to Edmondson Pike when you put the hold in the catalog to pick up, say, your tool set. Just select Edmondson Pike. We'll take it to that branch. We'll send you an email or call you when it's ready to pick up. You go get it. It's saving people money because I think I read in your notes that you wrote up, use before, you, try before you buy. Right? Yeah, Make sure you like right, it. Right. Yeah, exactly. That, that, was, that was what we were really thinking about was, okay, let's give folks a chance to try something before they buy it because money's you know tight yeah. right now when is it not ever tight but also um, if it's something you just need for a little while like if you just need to bake something mm -hmm. or if you just want to try a new I don't know exercise regime and you just like I don't know if this yeah. kettlebell things for me I'll check it out and try it yeah might as well Love well it. get in line for the radon detector <laughs> Larissa and you at home check out the library of things visit library.nashville.org slash Things, their inventory is being updated all the time. So check it out. Love it. Thank you.